Hello everyone. Um, in this video, I'll be talking about uh, uh, calculating the water saturation for uh, our basins for the wells. So this is well one, and in one well we have one basin here in horizon three, and we have another basin in horizon six, and we have another basin in horizon seven. Okay, so. We make an Excel sheet with well one, with zone one, zone two, and zone three. And we do the same for the rest of the wells with well three and well four. Okay, so um, we record the depth of our basin. So it's from 5,300 until 5,400, which is which is this one and then we record the, the thickness of that which is like a hundred and two feet and um, one thing to notice is that uh, in this reservoir we are using Simendox equation to calculate the, the water saturation and not Archie's equation because this is a uh, this is shaley sand so this is uh, this is Simondox equation to calculate the water saturation at Archie okay so you can just take a screenshot of these equations okay then we record the 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 density and the the neutron the porosity from the neutron and the porosity average okay um, the the values that don't have an equation it means it's taken from the log the rest is there is an equation for it so you should check with your formation evaluation lecture and slides We also here have a density correction for this reservoir. And this one is the Simendox equation. And we already know from the the CNL density that each zone uh, one what kind of hydrocarbon does it have or does it have gas oil or it has water until you reach to this final line okay uh, this 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 method uh, this Excel sheet is is more of a geology Excel sheet because it gives uh, only one value of of let's say water saturation for all of this uh, 102 feet okay so and and when we build our reservoir uh, we cannot just use one value for uh, 102 feet for water saturation it's, it's not accurate at all so we're gonna use a petrol calculator in the next video uh, to make a saturation log so the saturation log is 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 a is a range of values that is changing just like this gamma ray law for every depth interval so on these let's say 102 feet we have 50 readings of saturation instead of only one reading thank you very much